Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the series called Asma'ul Husna or the beautiful names and lofty attributes of Allah where I give a brief explanation of the definitions and meanings of the 99 names of Allah mentioned both in the Quran and Sunnah. For today's episode, we'll be talking about As-Salam, the giver and source of peace, the most perfect. And so today I wanted to talk about As-Salam, the most perfect, the source of peace, the giver of blessings. Allah is free from all imperfections or weaknesses. As-Salam means free from any kind of defect. Thus, Allah's attributes are free from any kind of imperfection. We can see in the Quran that a quality of Ibadur Rahman or the slaves of the most gracious is وَإِبَادُ الرَّحْمَانِ الَّذِي يَمَشُونَ عَلَى الْأَرْضِ حَوْنَ وَإِذَا خَاتَبَهُمُ الْجَاهِلُونَ قَالُوا سَلَامًا And the slaves of the most gracious are those who walk upon the earth easily. And when the ignorant address them harshly, they reply with the words of salam or peace. They say salam to the ignorant, meaning they don't want anything to do with their conversation, meaning they are free from them. Also, Jannah or paradise is called Daru Salam or home of peace. Wallahu yad'u ila dari salami wa yahdi man yasha'u ila sirati mustaqim. And Allah invites to the home of peace or paradise and guides whom He wills to a straight path. Meaning, Jannah or paradise is a place free from grief. Death, worries, tensions, tiredness, enmities, hatred. It is a place of safety. Also, when we say Assalamu Alaikum, it means you are safe from me and you will not receive any sharr or harm from me. Allah's name Assalam is mentioned once in the Quran. He is Allah, whom there is no God but Him, the King, the Holy One, the Salam. The one free from all defects. As-Salam is the one who is free from all imperfections and deficiencies because of the perfection of his being and his attributes and his actions. He is so perfect that he does not have any imperfections. For example, he is living and is free from imperfection of death. His knowledge is free from imperfection of forgetfulness. His attributes are free from imperfection of being similar to any created being. His actions are perfect, and whatever he does, there is hikmah or wisdom behind it. As-Salam is the one who is perfect. He has no deficiencies, and that is why As-Salam has been translated as the one free from any defects. From the Sunnah, we learn that the name As-Salam is mentioned in the Dua after Salah. Aisha reported, when the Messenger of Allah وسلم, finished his prayer, he would not sit long enough but say, Allahumma anta salam wa minka salam tabarakta ya dal jalali wal ikram. O oh Allah, you are the source of peace, and from you is peace. Blessed are you, O possessor of glory and honor. Why do we say this after Salah? Why do we not say, O oh Allah, you are Al Karim, the generous? And from you comes karam or generosity. Or you are Al-Aziz, Almighty. And from you comes is or might. There is profound wisdom here. Allahumma anta salam O oh Allah, you are as-salam. O oh Allah, you are the perfect. Whereas I have just finished a prayer which was full of deficiency or lack of khushu or humility. Wa minka salam And from you is as-salam. And from you comes perfection. You say this recognizing your imperfections. One whose ibadah or worship is full of deficiency. So you are saying this statement out of hope that Allah will rectify your salah. A salah or prayer in which there is no khushu or humility. It is struck back on the person and not taken. So it is as if you are saying, Oh Allah, if my salah was not proper, if there was anything you did not like, please keep me safe from its consequence. This is the benefit of following the sunnah. 
you are secure from things you do not even imagine. Allah is a salam. He is the one who grants peace and security to all his creation. Allah is above and beyond all weaknesses and inflictions, the source of peace and security for mankind. Stay tuned on the next installment of this series. I'll see you in the next episode. Hey, if you want to know the complete list of the 99 names of Allah, check out this video here.